Hey there guys, so we're gonna really take a quick look at this new software which is coming out called X-Portrait 2, uh, which is just really fantastic, superior uh, lip sync keen software that's coming out. Um, it's by uh, ByteSync or ByteDance, which you may have heard of, they're a Chinese company. Um, there's been a little bit of question about their uh, how they run their operation, but it's Chinese and they have different ways of doing things over there. But one thing you can certainly say is, is the Chinese are really bringing out some fantastic software. And this X-Portrait 2 is looking to be similar. So we're going to take a look at this. It has not been released yet, but good news, it's going to be released open source. Alert. So that is extremely exciting. So let's take a look at this, and I'm going to show you my thoughts on this as we get... Uh, excited for the release of exporter 2 but first go ahead and like the channel subscribe to it share it with the neighbors and and your relatives and all that in fact thanksgiving is a great time to come around when you're sitting at the table and saying what are you thankful for you can say i'm thankful that i'm able to get going fast with this ai stuff and uh, that will certainly be a table topic conversation so seriously though thank you so much um for being part of all of this growing so let's get on to checking out the cool lip syncing software that is coming out. Yo. All right. So as I mentioned, um, we've got the new X-Portrait 2. You can find this page just by doing a quick search for X-Portrait 2. Okay. And it's going to bring up here this GitHub page. So you just click it like that. And it's going to bring up this. Okay. Now, first off, you can tell this is just fantastic uh, quality. Now, obviously, whenever somebody puts out a new software or whatever, they're going to put out their best videos. But I'm telling you, this is pretty impressive. Notice the head is moving to the left, it's moving to the right, the expressionless of the expressions. The real thing here, guys, is we do not have good lip syncing software. Um, available for open source right now. We've got Live Portrait, and I like Live Portrait a lot, but it makes a lot of mistakes. You're not the only one who's got wants and needs, but I held on to your toy. I took all my feelings. All right, look my at the, wants, the wrinkles. The needs, Let's the make this big. Notice the wrinkles in her forehead. The, is this going down? Now, I want to point out another thing. See this hat here? The hat is impressive because if you work with Live Portrait or anything like this, when heads move and you've got a hat, the hat stays still, okay? It does not move with it, so it always makes it look weird. Obviously, they've captured the ability to not just change the face, but to move everything well. That alone is incredibly impressive, okay? There was something else I was going to show you. Oh, here it is. Notice this guy. What? Oh, we missed it. We'll come back. There's a thing about the tongues that you're going to see in some of these videos. I got a life, too. I get 18 years. Wow, look at the look at the emotion in her face. She's getting. Um, but anyway, you're going to see here. Let's go back here for just a second. It's going to come back around and you're going to see this tongue stick out. If anyone has done any work with face swapping stuff, um, when you stick out the tongue, it never works. It always um, it becomes translucent like you can see through it. Or um, it makes the lips kind of go, Ugh. it's 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 very odd. Same thing like when you're drinking or something like that. Okay, here, watch. He's going to do, look at that tongue. That's perfect. That's really incredibly perfect. That normally you would see through that tongue. That alone right there tells me that the software is like, is awesome. Okay, uh, let's scroll through a few more of these. You can come to the page and obviously check these out. Here you have one driving image. So this is the guy making his own image and is changing all of these. And notice this, this is obviously, these are both generated. And this is obviously, um, this one is not a simple generation. It's, it's like artwork, it's watercolors. And it's um, transforming that really well, which means that this model can actually take um, well done images and recreate it in different poses, which often when you run these things, uh, you'll put in say like a flux image and then you'll try to change it and, and it just changes it too much because the model that it's running on isn't as good as flux. So it will be um, 
<laughs> this is kind of trippy, this Android thing over here. It'll be trippy to see um, what model this is based on. Like, where, what are they using to create the initial images that they're changing? Because these are pretty good, good looking photos. Now notice this too. I want to point this out. See how his this is the drive for. See how his head is moving forward, but notice how their heads actually don't do anything weird. When you're using live portrait, if you move forward like this, it it warps the face. So I often in live portrait, I literally do this. I'll put my fingers on my head and I'll do it this just to keep my head still, and then I'll do everything I want to do so I'm not moving back and forth because it will mess up the image. But obviously they've fixed that. Okay, so now down here, notice it does some uh, comparison. The R's is this model. This is their last version, X Portrait, and then this is their competition, I'm assuming. Um, so notice this. This is obviously what we're looking at now. This is very good, high quality. Notice the uh, details. You've got a high resolution. So here's their last one. Notice it, it's a little bit jumpy. It's not as many frames per second, obviously. So it's, it's a bit jumpier and it's a bit smoother. It doesn't have as much detail. And then I get, again, I'm assuming this is their competition. Notice his head doesn't even turn. It has to stay straightforward because the model doesn't have the capability to track the head. To I mean, because literally every time it does it, it's recreating the image. It's recreating it here, it's recreating it here, 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 here. So this one over here doesn't have the ability to do that. And notice how smooth it looks. So you know what? This actually could be um, beyond just the face swapping lip sync. This could be a sign for our restorers. Uh, when you're doing... Um, like rope and you're working with um, restoration stuff, a lot of times it makes it look comical because it just smooths it out. So the fact that they're able to get this kind of quality out of here, that actually might mean something in the future too for uh, the stuff just in restoration beyond beyond uh, just this. But uh, yeah, so anyways, you can go around and look at this. The software is not released yet, but um, it will be released. If you go over here to X, um, I'll put the link up here for you so you can find it. There's this guy named El Cine. He's got all of these up here as well that you can look on. And you notice they set up here that it is open source. Okay, so that means they're going to be releasing these models for us to use. We're going to get to use these guys, which is great. And when stuff comes out, as open source, well, that means that anybody can do what they want with it. They can create new apps. I'm sorry, I'm looking for something here for you. Uh, but they can create new apps with it. I mean, they can take the technology, they can build something great, and that's going to all be released to us. Um, there, of course, will be online ones you have to pay for if you want to use it. But the truth of the matter is you're going to be able to do this off of your computer. And we here at Get Going Fast are going to help you get going fast when these come out. So I would, assume, I don't know when this is going to come out, but I would bet at the way everything moves, everything moves so fast. I bet this is out within the next couple of weeks. I don't think they would have released it if uh, they weren't getting the hype up. So uh, obviously keep track of this. This just going to be incredible and like i said there's been a um well, i don't know what the word is what's the opposite of a glut there's like a an absence of good lip syncing face swapping software so we're going to be definitely be keeping our eye on this here with x portrait 2 and bite dance and uh i'm looking forward to to seeing all the cool stuff that you guys are going to be making with it. But let me know what you think about it, uh, about the software. If you have insight that I don't have, which would be a lot. I don't have a whole ton of insight. I install software and I teach you guys how to do the same. Um, so let me know what you know. I'd love to hear it and we'll share it here on the channel. In the meanwhile, I want you guys to stay good, get excited for the future because the future is so bright that we got to wear shades, yo. In fact, I wish I had some shades right now because... This is looking so bright. All right, you guys hang in there. We'll chat up to you next time. And as usual, yo.